Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven, and in today's video, I would like to show you how you can add a nice photo, a nice header image to this header area on the SharePoint site. Uh, now, up until recently, uh, the only thing we could do here uh, was really just change the uh, color palette, um, you know, the theme, if you will, uh, of that header. Uh, but luckily now, uh, with some improvements that Microsoft made on SharePoint uh, pages, we can now actually include a photo in here uh, that will uh, pretty much stretch uh, all the way from the left to all the way on the right uh, of the screen. Let me show you how to do that. It's not that obvious, so let me show you. What you need to do is obviously navigate to that site, navigate to that page, gear icon, change the look, click on header. And this is, you know, where you can set the different colors and everything from for the header. All right. And it might not be that obvious, you know, because there is really no area for you to upload that image. What you need to do is change the layout, the style of the header. If you notice at the moment, it's compact layout. Uh, what you need to do is, and there are obviously different ones available here, but the one you need to pick is extended right here. So it's kind of the the highest one, I guess, the biggest header you can get. Once you do that, you will notice another area pop up over here on the side panel, and this is where you can upload the image. Again, if I choose any other layout, uh, the section is gone, so make sure to choose extended. And this is where I can upload the image, so let me do just that. And the image I have chosen uh, was uh, a skyline of Boston, Massachusetts, uh, my favorite city. So right here, you can actually uh, kind of change the focus of the image right here by moving the slider. Here we go, all right. And once you're happy, uh, just click Save. And uh, by the way, right, if you obviously don't like the image, you can always change it, you can always remove it and go back to um, the regular colors. So, but let's save it, let's see how it looks. And here we go. This is how it looks at the end. I mean, obviously, right, the image was just a random image I, I have chosen. You you probably have to, you know, uh, choose uh, the one that kind of suits your, uh, you know, theme and uh, brand, etc. Uh, but the bottom line is you can now add an image to each and every uh, site. One thing I want to clarify is that whatever we just did, and this happened to be a part of my internet hub, this does not propagate down to the rest of the site. So if I, let's say, go to another site right here, uh, which is part of that same hub, uh, it has its own header and you can choose a unique layout here. You can choose a unique image here. So the bottom line is the header does not propagate to the rest of the site in case if you use a hub site. That's what I was trying to say. All right, so that's all I really wanted to cover today in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.